Hi, Karen here with your weekly wrap up for Friday, April the 28th. Corn was lower this week on beneficial moisture in Brazil and after China canceled several purchases of US corn. Good planting progress and weak export sales pressured soybeans. Moisture in the US Southern Plains and Statistics Canada's report estimating Canadian wheat acres to be the highest in over 20 years pushed wheat down. Commodity fund selling added to the weakness in prices. Canola saw losses this week on spillover from the liquidation in the other grain and oilseed markets, as well as weakness in crude oil. This week, July canola was down $26.50, closing at 7.03.40 per ton. Soybeans were down 30 cents, closing at $14.19 per bushel. Corn was down 30 cents, closing at $5.85 per bushel. Minneapolis spring wheat was also down this week. It was down 42 cents, closing out the week at $8.04 per bushel. The Canadian dollar was up one basis point this week, closing at 73.90. And crude oil was down $1.13, closing at 76.74 per barrel. Next week, we look for canola futures to attempt to hold support at the $700 level. For July Minneapolis wheat futures, we look for the market to trade on both sides of $8. That's our wrap up for this week. Thanks for joining me.